superstar first graders welcome to your new grade one learning journey and new video we'll discover fantastic stories participate in exciting activities and learn interesting information together on this beautiful adventure so put on your explorer hats because every day is a treasure of knowledge waiting to be found the lessons that will be covered during this week. On Sunday, we will learn to spell short U sounds. On Monday, we will learn about consonants R, W, J, and K. And we will continue learning about short U words. On Tuesday, we will introduce the new procedural text story titled Making a Map. On Wednesday, we will learn about complete sentences. And Thursday, we will learn about a nice lesson called rhyming words. In spelling, we will learn about the short U words. And the spelling words for this week are bunk, hug, tug, dug, and jug. Remember that the sound of short U is ah. Now let's learn to use these words into sentences. The jug is full of water. Can I hug you? Bugs have six legs. Ali tugged on the rope. The dog dug a hole. In phonics, we will learn about consonants R, W, J, and K. And we will continue learning about the short U words. So let's start with the short U words. Again, the sound of U is A, uh, as in sun, bug, nut, cub, bus, cup, and bud. The sound of consonant J is J, as in jam, jump, jet, juice, and jar. They all begin with the J sound. The sound of R is R, as in rabbit, ring, rat, rock. Rattle and red. The sound of W is w, w, as in wagon, whip, watermelon, wind and world. The sound of the consonant K is K, as in kite, king, koala and jacket. This week's short story is procedural text. Procedural text explains how you do or make something. It includes the directions of doing anything or the steps you need to follow. This week's story is titled Making a Map and it's a procedural text. So what makes this text a procedural text? It tells us the steps to make a map. Why do you think the author labels the picture? The labels help the readers know what things on a map are called. Why are there steps to making a map use text evidence? You have to make a map in order. First, we need to make a list. Sentences. A sentence is a group of words that makes a complete sense or a complete idea. A sentence must begin with a capital letter and must end with a full stop. We learned earlier that a sentence must have two parts. Who or what is the sentence about or the telling part or a verb or we might call it the subject and the predicate. If I say Raya, 
This is not a sentence because we are missing the telling part. If I say goes to school, again, this is not a sentence because it does not have a complete idea and it does not make sense and it's missing the subject. Rhyming words are words that have the same ending sound. Let's look at the pictures here. We have hat and bat. The ending sound is at. So hat and bat end with at. We have cat and mat. They have again the same ending sound which is at. Let's look at the second example. We have dog and log. The ending sound is og. We have sun and fun. They have the same ending sound, which is un. Ball and tall. Again, they have the same ending sound, which is all. B and tree. They have the same ending sound, which is E. Car and star, they have the same ending sound, which is R. So rhyming words, we look at the ending sounds.